God, this is nice. I only brought this with me because I was just checking it out. But this is my go-to, a fluke, anyway. I guarantee there's something in here. I used to just fish with bread, a hook, and line tied to a stick. Hang out next to a little old creek and see what I get. All right, well, I had to come back here today, brought the kids. So they'll be making plenty of noise and scaring a bunch of fish, but I think there's enough in here. I'll be able to catch something. There it is. Oh, that's a nice one. Look at that, I already caught one. What? Oh my God. <laughs> We're not even playing around here, guys. Yeah. That's a nice one. It's got some weight on him. Let me get a scale out here. All right, zeroed out there. Let's clip it on here and see what this guy weighs. One point two. One point one two. So that means the ones I caught the other day were two to three pounds man all right let's let him go here now you see why i like this creek right that was quick well i just had to come back to this spot i know there's some nice bass in here but it's just pretty even so fixing to walk up through there try to get away from these kids over here hollering around there we go <clears throat> splashing in the water nice ow nice looking little guy he's pretty solid that's for sure a little too small for me to want to put the scale on him but my guess is it is a spotted bass because that's connected and this doesn't go behind the eye plus his mouth's kind of small so let's let him go here there he goes all right well i got up here and it felt like it's worth it. God, this is nice. I only brought this with me because I was just checking it out. But this is my go-to, a fluke, anyway. I guarantee there's something in here. Man, I wish I had the rest of my stuff. That is beautiful up through there. This creek, every time I come here, something different and it's amazing i mean i like to just catch any size fish but these big bass in this creek here is a little addicting it rained last night so this water is a little murky right now um honestly this creek here it typically is it's not as clear as some of the other creeks i fish but <laughs> this creek puts out the bass i mean it's kind of ridiculous i've never caught this many bass in one little creek there we go there he is all right just kind of wiggle it around there jerk it sometimes I, I with these flukes sometimes i reel them fast sometimes it's slow Holy cow, look at the eyes on that. That thing's eye is crazy. It's huge. Beautiful little fish, though. Healthy, that's for sure. I'm not going to get an underwater release of this guy. I'm just going to let him go. 
Oh, of course. He hangs out. Yeah, I wish I would have got an underwater release. Way to go. Thanks, bud. I'm just going to try fishing it fast. I mean, when you know there's fish there, just change up your presentation, really. You don't even have to change your lure half the time. Like, I've been fishing this slow, and it worked down there, but I, I notice sometimes I'm running a little quicker, and then I catch stuff. Oh, see? Look at that. I started reeling it real fast, and here's what you get. Nice. Wasn't expecting that at all. I was actually about to reel it and just get it out of the water. Yeah. Nice little guy. That's what I'm saying, you know. I threw it out there probably like six or seven times. Same spot. Worked it different every time. And then I just basically gave up just then. It's like, I'll just reel it in. And I'm just going to burn it by them. And this is what you end up with. A fish. So, let's go ahead and get him back here in the water. Whoa, try to come back at me, huh? I see you. All right, come on, trout magnet crawl, Dad. Something out there wants you. There it is. Oh, yeah, I got you guys a bass. Oh, look at him. Yeah, it is. And he's a jumper, that's for sure. Yeah, this is a smallmouth bass. Wow. He took that real deep. All right. We got that out, no problem. Kind of surprised, though, but... Anyway, we're going to let him go. And that would have probably ripped the fish's guts out if I didn't have one of these bad boys. So I'm gonna just put that on there, kind of hook it down and bump it a little bit and then pull it right on out. Let's see if anything's over in here. Hope I don't get hung up. 